What is going on guys? My name is Deadly. Welcome back. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys what I have been doing the past five days to make roughly over 2 million coins plus. You're probably saying, Deadly, how do you get these coins? How do you get these coins? First off, if you guys want to get these coins, you got to make sure you're subscribed to this YouTube channel. Make sure you're subscribed. And if you guys are new to the channel, make sure to subscribe again, like I just said before. And make sure to hit the like button. It'll help you grow up the channel. And let me know in the comment section down below. How many coins did you make off of this bet? So let's start off. The first, the first thing you're probably saying, bet deadly. What do you do to get so many coins? It's simple. It's the easiest method right now, and the best coin making method right now. Get a player packs. You're probably saying, deadly. I don't want to rip. Get a player packs. I get bored. If you're, I'm. If you go, if you want to rather play online, thirty minutes, probably thirty minutes, like an hour, you probably play like two, three games, and rip ma and average like what, five k coins. You could do that, but I could average. I could do that like in, in about an hour, an hour and a half, and I could average myself roughly about 50k. You guys could take advantage of your time. But to me, I could play online a little bit like that, or I could do the gift player method and save my coins to get myself ready for Weekend League. Because Weekend League is the only thing I freaking care about in Madden. And you need to get yourself a team. So, what I've been doing, I've been testing out the get a player pack method for the past like 5 days since I talked about it last Sunday. It was pretty glitchy. I tested it out, tested it out, tested it out, kept on testing it out, and I found out this is very, very underrated. You pull so many elite cards, you pull so many power-ups, and you pull so many high golds. So, what you're saying, Deadly, what do I have to do? You're probably saying, Deadly, what do I have to do to get these coins? Well, explain to me what you do. So, I rip, you can rip between 200k to 100k to 150k. Roughly around there because you need to pull over a lot of packs to basically maximize your profit. And to give yourself a higher chance of pulling these high golds. Because that's what's going to make us the profit. So, what are you going to be doing? So after, let's say after you open all the 100k worth of let's get a player packs, you want to go to the exchange sets, and you want to exchange all your silvers to gold and all your low golds to high golds from this section. You know what I'm saying, deadly? Why? Why am I going to Superstar MVP? The fact is you don't want to go to that section is because every single person is doing that method. Therefore, all the cards, the Superstar MVP gold cards are going for a minimum 1,000 coins. You're saying, what? They're going for 1,000 coins? That's not worth it then. It is not worth it, guys. It's rather, I will rather spend the extra gold card here and give myself at least a chance to be able to pull those power-ups. Because there's a few power-ups that go for a lot. Especially the 50 power-ups that just dropped in the game. Vernon Davis, the both of the Cromarties, I believe Culpepper, and there's a few more that goes for at least 50k plus. And if you can pull one of those cards, you just maximize your profit. So after you do all this, what do I do? I have to turn all my silvers to high golds. What I do is here, I go over to the 50 set, and what I do is turn all my high 77 golds to 83 cards. If you guys probably say, I don't think you do, I don't think you're doing it right. I don't think you're really taking advantage of this method. I'm not taking advantage of this method. Look how many gold cards I have. How many 83s I have? I have 31, 31, 25. You're probably saying, Deadly, I don't think you're, I think you're buying out the, you're buying the cards. You're not getting them from the get a player method. Uh, if you don't think so, guys, I will show you guys. Look. If I go over here right now, you guys will see I have a total, I believe, 150, around 100 and what's the total of how many get high goals? I have 146, and we are going to be checking my recent sales that I believe I have, and we're going to be seeing where does it say that I bought a card. All right, guys, we're going to give me a second. Okay, we're going to go check right now. Just manage to load up because it's going really slow right now. All right, let's check. Auction sold, 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 sold. I'm gonna keep going through like this, and I'm gonna tell you guys why. I am not, I'm not buying those cards. I am making them. That is how good this method is. As you guys will be seeing, my last 200 sales, you're gonna see what I've been selling. I've been selling literally every single thing gold card I get. I'm selling, and I've been making those A3 as my backups. As you guys will be seeing, I'm just selling cards. Where does it say that I'm buying these cards? That means if I'm not buying these cards, I'm selling them. That's why I'm telling you guys the best method right now is get a player. I'm going to keep going through them while I tell you guys. So, And then what you want to do, you want to sell all your 75 to 76 gold cards for roughly about 1,500 coins. And you're going to be making a lot of profit. You're probably saying, Deadly, why don't I make the 82 old cards? Because those cards just drop like crazy in price those shits drop so much in price that they're not worth doing they're roughly selling for roughly 12 a lot 12 000 coins even cheaper so they're not worth doing because if you sell them for a thousand five hundred eleven seventy five cards you'll be making a minimum seventeen thousand coins sixteen thousand coins and you want me you want to lose you'll be losing 5k every single time you make yourself an 82 card and you on top of that making four 
making a high gold card, you're already losing a little bit of coins. So you might as well take your risk and just cash out and selling all your gold cards for about 1,500 coins. As you guys can see, I'm not, I'm telling you guys, I'm not buying these cards. These cards, I'm selling them. I am selling them, as you guys will be seeing over here. I do not buy. I have a couple buys, but those are not the things I bought. They're not. These are Team of the Week cards because that's how many times I was doing the Josh Allen set. Now, these are cards that I tried to buy them last second because they were good. They were sniped. They were selling for roughly 25 k earlier today, but those are some of them, and I tried to resell them for a little bit of profit. But I'm telling you guys, Get a Player Method is the very is one of the best coin-making methods right now. So I'm going to show you guys everything I've sold. Look at everything I've sold here. Everything I've sold. This is everything I pulled from Get a Player Packs. Everything I have pulled. Everything. I'm telling you guys right now, Get a Player Packs are really juiced up, and you guys should take advantage of it quickly. So, repeat myself again. What do I need to do? Buy roughly about 100k and Get a Player Packs. Turn everything to high golds from the regular exchange. Don't go to Superstar MVP. And then you want to sell every single 75 and 76 gold cards for roughly 1,500 coins. And you want to put them up for 8 hours and you don't have to worry about that. Put 20 of them up. Don't worry about it. Grind some solos. Boom. And you'll be getting your profit back. And, and the every 77 gold cards you want to do, you want to make them into the 83s. And because roughly at the minimum, you're probably going to be making about roughly, I believe every 100k, I usually pull like around 40 of those cards. So if I sell all those 40 cards for the minimum of 2,000 coins, that is 80k profit. Or you can take advantage of them and make some 83s and save them to get yourself these 50 cards for really cheap. Guys, but that's the video, guys. Hope you guys did enjoy this video. Make sure to like this, but hit the like button down below. Tell me how many coins did you guys make off of this coin making method because it is very, 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 very good. People all I told everyone about this on Twitter, and every single one of them told me every single time they do it, they are making at least minimum 50k every single time doing. I ripped the last time I, I did 200k, and I actually managed to pull about roughly 150k profit. That's how good these, part, these packs are. Hope, I'm sorry guys if I was stuttering in this video. I apologize. I'm still trying to learn to schedule the thing out. But that is the video guys. Hope you guys did enjoy this video. Make sure to hit the like button down below. And I'll see you all in the next one. Peace.